Hi there, this is Abhishek and in this video I will talk about the sheet level security settings. So in the previous video I have talked about the security settings at document level which impacts uh, the entire document and in this video I will look at the specific sheet and uh, see what are all the settings that is available within the sheet properties uh, window so that we to allow or not allow for end users. So for that, let's go to the sheet properties. Alternatively, you can press Control Alt S, and after that, you can go into the security tab, where you have some of the security settings like uh, Add Sheet Objects, which says that you want to allow users to add the sheet objects. So there is no harm. Sometimes they want to allow the, uh, they want to create some sheet objects for their specific analysis. After that, you have Remove Sheet Objects, where you to remove the sheet objects uh, which is currently available so they are not the only one which they have added but any of the one which is currently available so it is recommended that you should uh, uh, enable this but with a cautious or some some uh, guide guidance that you are giving to the user that they should not remove any of the sheet object move or size uh, size sheet objects where they can move the sheet objects from here to there Generally, it is not recommended because you have worked on the design and everything based on requirements and then, you know, you are, if you are allowing them, then they are messing up with your design. So, generally, it is not recommended to move or size the sheet objects. Copy and clone sheet objects, I think, these are fine because you are just allowing them to create a similar object because otherwise they need to create uh, some object from the scratch and that will require some kind of a technical skill. But with a normal skill, they can just copy or clone the existing object and make some uh, minor changes based on their requirement. So it is fine to enable this setting. Access sheet object properties. So if they want to access the sheet object property page, then they can, then you can allow this. Generally it is fine to enable this. And then remove sheet. I think it is not recommended. Uh, in in general scenario where because they may remove any of the sheet on which you have done a lot of work uh, in that way it will create a user experience issues for other users so generally it is not recommended to enable this setting and finally um, access sheet properties the sheet properties page which you are currently accessing if you want the users to allow this sheet property page to be accessible then you can enable this so generally uh, i would recommend that uh, do not allow that because then they can come in and mess up mess up with the information which we have set over here so after that if you just want this setting to be applied on this particular sheet then just keep this thing unchecked this option apply to all sheet otherwise if you want that the similar setting should be enabled for all the sheet then you can click on this apply to all sheet and the same settings will be applied to the every sheet which is present in the document. So that's pretty much all I wanted to discuss in this video and I'll meet you in the new video, the new topic.